I think I did. Well, if not, you know, I'll be a teacher. I don't mind teaching. Yeah, I right. can talk a lot. That's all I care about. <laughs> okay, I think I'm on there. Yeah. First what? of all, how's it going? Yeah, good man, real good. Yeah. You was in uh, Nottingham last night, was it? Yeah, first night, yeah. A bit jittery, making yeah. nerves and stuff. But oh, it was this, good. Is a, this is pretty big. Yeah, it? yeah, it's a massive jump for us, yeah, for sure. I mean, you was on tour with Frank. Uh, was it a year ago or two years ago? Uh, I, think, <laughs> I think it was the start of like last year. Yeah, yeah. The last run we did, but yeah. Uh, those were a somewhat smaller venue, really. Yeah, like it's three, four hundred yeah. camp. Yeah, yeah. This yeah, cool. is the big deals. Yeah. And also, uh, your new album's just come out. Yeah, man. Yeah, well, it's not just come out. No, nah, yeah, it's in April, out. but like, yeah, it's been real good. Then. Like, Have you had a uh, good kind of like feedback from it? Yeah, definitely. Like, like, people. Uh, I mean, like from the press side of it, definitely. Yeah, yeah. Um, more importantly for us though, like yeah, we're playing shows now in places we've never been to, and there's people turning up and like singing along <laughs> and stuff. Thing, like yeah. yeah, so it's cool. Like. People actually turning up. Yeah. And also, uh, you had a single come out as well. Yes. Yeah. 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 I would search for the video for that. Yeah. What? Well, in, in, well, in, yeah. 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 We were pretty pleased with that. It was the guy. The guys who directed it actually. They're like friends of ours. Um, yeah. They basically had they've had the idea for ages and they came into it like with us like. Yeah, it's cool. And uh, also the album, the singles off the album, and the album was produced by Pete Miles. Yes. He's kind of become like the extra man go to guy, hasn't he? <laughs> Everyone yeah, seems yeah. to be going to. He's Pete. like, he's just got such a good way with it. Yeah. Like, and he really yeah. like, uh, I don't know, he understands like what what you're trying to do, and he, he like has the same vision as you basically. Yeah. yeah. Or tries to adopt your vision, I guess. Which is so, yeah. as far as it can go. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah. I mean, yeah. it works anyway. I mean, they all have the songs. Sweet. Yeah, I mean we're pleased with it. It's like the good thing about Pete's place is that it gives us because we like pretty much still recording almost entirely live. So like, yeah, yeah. So we wanted it to be able to do that sort of thing. Mm -hmm. So I think it's good to do it like that sometimes because it kind of maintains that, yeah. that energy, like kind yeah, of like definitely. live energy. A lot of recordings, yeah, lack that. Can feel it sometimes. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. So what do you do? Just record the instrumentation live and then all the dub the vocals. Just do vocal after. Yeah, yeah that's yeah. the only thing. It's mainly just because it would bleed so much between the rooms. Sort of yeah, 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 definitely. Yeah. Now I was looking last night on uh, the BBC website. I think it was BBC Gloucestershire. Yes. A guy called Stephen Morris. Yes. Did you read that? Um, he seems to really like you. I uh, have. I've read some of his stuff. Yeah. Is it a review? The album review. It's just a it? kind of general review of you. It doesn't mention the new album, but it was basically saying that a lot of music's gone shit and stale, and everything's just trying to be Coldplay. Yeah. 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 But he said you're not. Amazing. That's good. So yeah. It's really nice. Nice really to be. Fine. All the way from that. Yeah, the yeah. one thing he did say, which I wanted to ask you about, was he, he mentioned that you were a political band. Yeah. You know, would you consider yourself a political band? No, not really. I mean, there's a couple of songs that are definitely politically kind of driven. Yeah, yeah. But it's more like rants, really. They're not like, <laughs> it's not like, it's not like saying you must join our, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. to do this and whatever. It's just like me being pissed off and that sort of thing, basically. So just having a bit of a strop. Yeah, just having a bit of a strop. <laughs> like, it's the only way you can get away with it, really. Put it over some core. Are you also did your own tour recently as well. Mm, yeah. Recently. Yeah, yeah. We did. Um, we were out with the band of the people of power for yeah. like a few days, like just over a week actually. Wicked. They're really good guys. And they're like, what was it? You played their song control in Manchester, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We did that. that. Yeah, it was good. Like we did like the smaller room, but yeah, um, yeah. yeah, it was. Yeah, it's amazing, man. Like Manchester's becoming like one of those places that we get really excited about going to. Yeah, so yeah. It's cool, yeah. Like, there's the you always kind of have, to know not your favourites I guess, but there are certain your cities favorites. that work better, like or feel like they work better. Um, like every night they go, like, this is our favourite city. You know? <laughs> yeah, most She's of the time. She's trying to put me up by saying it's Manchester. <laughs> that's all you're doing. <laughs> not at all. But no, I've spoken to quite a few people in Manchester, and they said, "Jim, like your songs are going to be big. Yeah, they're going to be big." A lot of people keep telling us that at the moment. So you know, it's a bit weird. Cool though. I mean, like, I'm glad that people are getting into it and really believing it. We just don't want to get too mixed up in that, really. Yeah, I mean, yeah. We just yeah. want to try and stay just doing whatever we're doing. Have you been getting any kind of like mainstream play, like major music channels? I mean, like we get in major radio stations. We started like to now. Like we've had some stuff with Radio One, like Zayn Low and stuff, which was cool. Um, and like the videos getting the newer videos yeah, gonna yeah. get a little bit more like TV play and stuff like that. So yeah, it's good. It's definitely good. It's really really good. So I guess the final question is, what's next? Ah. Uh, cliche final question. Yeah. <laughs> well, we're like we do this tour with Frank, and then yeah. 
And then next year we've got another tour, which is like five weeks long. It starts in January and ends in March. No way. Yeah, so 30th of January till like the 4th of March, I think it is or something. Um, yeah, crazy. But yeah, that's, I mean, that'd be amazing. Mm -hmm. And then I guess in that interim period, it's just writing, I guess. And then Do you plan on trying to get a new another one? Another one, yeah. I think it's going to be, kind of thing. yeah, I mean, the way it's shaping up at the moment, though, it's drastically different. So I don't really know where. I don't know. Just have to see what happens. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right, don't worry, we're done now. It's all right. All right, well, thank you very much. Mate, pleasure. Thanks, Good man. Time. Thank you. Cheers,